Hi everybody, oh, my name is Katie. I just wanted to make a quick video and talk kind of a little bit about what is going on with my hand and my arm. Sorry, my fingers are dirty apparently. <laughs> so, um, I work at a grocery store. I don't know if I'm allowed to say which one. Um, it is a like, really fast-paced grocery store. And uh, one day I was at my register scanning groceries and my arm just started hurting uncontrollably. And um, right near the elbow region here. And uh, I'm like, well, this really hurts. I don't know what it is. Um, so they let me go to the work doctor. And um, they were like, okay, it's tennis elbow. Um, it's just for moving your arms back and forth a lot like this. You know, scanning groceries and, you know, stocking, rotating, grabbing, lifting, carrying. Everything that I do at this grocery store. And um, so... I went, started going to a physical therapist. They put me off workman's comp because I'm not able to use my hand or my arm. So I went on workman's comp, started seeing a physical therapist, and um, they were like, okay, yep, it's tennis elbow. Let's do some physical therapy to try to fix it. And um, here, I'm going to go to... Apparently, I can't flip the camera around. That sucks. I wanted to turn it over on me. Maybe I'll just do this. So, anyway, they wanted to, um, what was I trying to say? <laughs> they sent me to the physical therapist. We did physical therapy for about a week. They gave me steroids, icy hot. We started doing a bunch of muscle work. And, um, then the pain started to go away. I'm like, okay, this is great. I can go back to work. This is the first week in August, by the way. And then, um, I noticed that, uh, I couldn't move my hands or my fingers. You see how they just are stuck hanging like this? Oh, man, I was just wiping off eyeliner with my hands, so it was all, all dirty. I should probably have washed them. Um, but, yeah, my fingers just stay curled over, and they won't go up. My wrist goes up to the right. It doesn't go up straight. It kind of does now because we were doing chiropractic work on it. But, um, anyway, yeah, so my fingers don't go up. My thumb, it only moves side to side. It won't, it won't lift up. Like, I can't physically lift my hands. I can't open my hand up either. They just stay curled over like this. So we were trying to figure out why in the world this was happening. And um, so they were like, okay, we need to send you to some, uh, a, a, what do they call it, a neurologist? To do some nerve testing. Um, that way we can figure out, you know, what is going on with my nerves. And um, so I went in and did a nerve test called an EMG. They stick like little needles in your arms I guess and they kind of shock your muscles and they test your nerve function and they're like okay yeah you have classic post interosseous nerve compression disorder or pin compression disorder basically my radial nerve is being trapped by like a supernator muscle or something like that and um they're like okay we this is a, a procedure you have to have surgical decompression on like Okay, probably in eight weeks we'll get you for the surgery. So this was in August, and my surgery was in October, like mid-October. And um, so I had my surgery, as you can see, October 13, and they gave me three to six months to recover. And it's been uh, two and a half months, and so far no progress. Um, my doctor said if I don't see any progress in another eight weeks, they're going to have to do additional testing. So, yeah, my fingers don't open up. My wrist hurts incredibly bad from the strain of, have, of trying to lift my fingers, and it's putting so much pressure on the wrist. My, like, I just feel my wrist bone feels like it's going to snap from working so hard, you know. And it really sucks because I am left-handed. So, I'm going to show you the um, brace that I'm supposed to be wearing it's a it's a custom made brace, and um, here I'm gonna put it on real quick. Okay, so this is what it looks like on. As you can see, it's very intricate. It's uh got little finger slings that mimic my tendons. These little strings here attached to rubber bands that go down and clip at the very end. You know, fastens right on here. I have a little sock thing underneath to keep my arm warm because it's winter time. So as you can see, this um, kind of lifts up my fingers and lets me move them around. It lets me open and use my thumb more, even though I can't lift my thumb up still. Um, but yeah, this thing is very embarrassing. Extremely embarrassing. Everybody in public has a comment on it. Whoa, what is that? 
you look like Spider-Man, you look like Edward Scissorhands, or the Terminator, and people in the grocery store are always wondering, what in the world happened to you? And people always ask, is it painful? No. Is it annoying? Yes. I can't do anything with my hand. This is my dominant hand. It really sucks. So, anyway, that's a little bit about post or nerve compression disorder, at least my experience with it. Um, this has really been nothing short of a nightmare. I am just so ready to get back to work. I'm still on workman's comp. They won't let me go back to work because I have to have full use of my hand in order to work because of the high level of uh, activity that we do at this job. There's no, like, sit-down areas where I can work. It's all, like, you have to do all or nothing, basically. Cashiering, stocking, rotating, lifting, carrying... So, yeah, basically, I'm just kind of screwed until it's fixed, and uh, this is a waiting game. There's nothing you can do to make your nerves go faster, um, nothing you can eat, no topical ointments, no exercise. It's basically like your nerves regrow really slowly. I think they said like an inch a month, depending on how high up in my arm the nerve was damaged, and it's just going to take longer. And they don't know how much of my nerve was fixed or damaged. They said it looked healthy during the surgery, so it could be higher up. I don't know. So, anyway, that's all for me. I'll probably do a more informative video about what post or nerve compression disorder is. Uh, I know it's really confusing, but basically I can't move my fingers. And the nerve has got to regrow, and it's going to take a long time. So... Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.